Hello everybody. In this video, we are going to integrate our cosine of x. For this integration, it's good to know derivative of our cosine of x and integration by parts formula. We are going to rewrite our cosine of x as a product of two functions. So we can utilize integration by parts. In our case, we are going to use 1 times our cosine of x. Now we have two functions, 1 and our cosine of x. One of them will be our u, the other one will be our v prime, which is dv. So we're going to pick up u, which we can take the derivative, and we're going to take dv, which we can take the integral. So our u is our cosine of x. then the derivative of our cosine of x is negative 1 over square root of 1 minus x squared. Our dv is 1 dx. And antiderivative of 1 dx with respect to x is x. So here, 1 dx times our cosine of x. This is our u, this is our v prime, or dv. Now we're going to apply u times v u times v, which is x times our cosine of x, minus integral of v du. You can use the table you created here. v is x, and du is negative 1 over square root of 1 minus x squared dx. Now, this part of integral is done. Now, we have to take care of this part of integral. Here, we are going to apply another substitution. Let's apply w substitution. Let w be 1 minus x squared. Then dw will be negative 2x dx. Now we are going to write everything in terms of w. So negative integral negative x times 1 over square root of w and here if you solve for dx, dx will be equal to negative dw over 2x. So instead of dx in our integral, we are going to write negative dw over 2x. Here two negative signs multiply to positive, x's cancel out, and we can pull one half to the front of the integral sign. So for this integral we obtain negative one half integral of 1 over square root of w dw. Now we know how to integrate this. Let's rewrite everything. We have x our cosine of x minus 1 half integral of instead of square root of w we can write w to the 1 half and we take it to the numerator as w to the negative 1 half dw. Now we can apply power rule. So w to the negative one half, we add one and divide it by the power, negative one half plus two over two. So here we obtain w to the one half divided by one half. This one half cancels this one half and we have x r cosine of x minus w to the 1 half plus c. Let's bring our w back. Our w was 1 minus x squared and to the power of 1 half means square root. So 1 minus x squared plus c. Our cosine of x. So this is our answer.